classes started today at the largest school in Tucson, Pima Community College. With the return of nearly 45,000 students to six campuses, safety is top of mind. We compared statistics at PCC and the U of A. Between 2012 and 2014, only three forcible sexual offenses were reported across all of PCC's campuses compared to 27 rapes at the U of A in 2014 alone. In 2014, 12 aggravated assaults reported at the U of A, only three at PCC between 2012 and 2014. And in 2014, 41 burglaries at the U of A, only eight at PCC's six main campuses. Nine on your sides, Max Darrow is live at PCC's West Campus with more. Well, Guy, here on campus, I was walking around for the first day, and I did see an increased police presence, just making sure students are safe. What you're also going to find on campus are these blue light systems. You'll see them in the parking lot and throughout campus as well. That being said, even with the lower crime statistics than the University of Arizona, I asked the question, do students feel safe here at PCC? Well, today on their first day of a new semester, here's what some of them had to say. Just under 45,000 students at Pima Community College back in class. And police, faculty, and students all seem to agree that campus is a safe place. There are some places where you go and you go, I better make sure I'm safe, I better look over my shoulder. This is just not one of those places. Here on the West Campus, you can see this parking lot is pretty big. And what that means is a long walk to your car if you're a student taking a night class. Officers will walk students to their car if they request it. But for the most part, students tell me they feel pretty safe. Parking lots are all very well lit. Um, and there are multiple other students that take night classes also. So you never feel alone either. The college has an alert system that will text students and faculty if there's an unsafe situation on any of the campuses, but third-year student Adrian Thompson says that rarely happens. Pima is really good about sending you notifications if there's anyone that is a threat to anyone. Well, I've been here six years and I think I've gotten two. So, yeah, it, and that system works great because it lets all of us know what's going on at all the different campuses. PCC Police Commander David Giddings takes pride in the way the department patrols the campuses. Pima College is an extremely safe place for your children and your family to come and study and learn. Now, we're not saying that PCC is crime-free. Neither, neither are they. In fact, PCC offers a self-defense class for women. One is coming up this weekend. The police and community service officers will walk people to their cars. If they do ask for an escort, that's just a reminder for students with the new start of the new year. Reporting from the West Campus, Max Darrow, KGUN 9, on your side. 